I now do raffles on my Instagram daily, so if you're into that kind of stuff and want to join a future one, shoot my Instagram a follow. It's jcresells559. Same exact name as my YouTube name. Thank you guys for the support, and I hope to see you in the future raffle. What is up, everyone? This huge mystery box just delivered to me today. I don't know who exactly it's from because I have a few on the way from different people. So, yeah, there's not really much else to say. Like I said earlier, this is a pretty big box. I'm going to guess this might be 2000 But, yeah, let's just get it open. Hopefully, there's no inside and let's see what's in it. All right, here we go. Just got it cut open. Let's see how this is looking inside. So, here's how the box is looking. Try and get a good angle of it, but yeah let's get into this as you can see i opened it backwards all the shoes are upside down but let's go with this this is a size nine you could tell what it is based off the box and then it says display right here this might have been he might have got this at a retail store here they are the yellow taxi jordan ones I actually have a few pairs of these but yeah they are brand new so here's the first shoe from this box and a size nine for the taxis they are going for 200 200 for that. That's the first shoe. Pretty good one. Let's go with... <laughs> this just fell out of the box. No box lid right here. This is a Jordan 8. Here they are. It comes with this. But here's the shoes. I do not get Jordan 8s often, so this is my first Jordan 8 in a very long time. See the colorway on it? It's like a wheat brown. Some black and red on it. Extra laces. Let me see if this is a B-grade or not, because there is no box lid. Doesn't show B-grade on the size tag. So, yeah, I don't know. I don't really know what happened to the box lid, but here's the next shoe, Jordan 8s. So, a size 11 for these, going for about 250 Because of no box lid, though, and, I mean, Jordan 8s are usually pretty harder for me to sell. I'm going to mark this at 200 So, 200 for that. Retail, by the way, is 225 so yeah they're not going for that much over retail let's go on here i believe this is a jordan 2 box in a size 11. and here they are the chicago jordan 2s jordan 2 is another shoe that's usually tougher for me to sell but at least it's a good colorway chicago colorway is usually easier to sell or the unc colorways in a size 11 they're going for 220. so 220 for that 620 here's the first three shoes different varieties so far got some jordan ones jordan twos jordan eights so let's keep it going here here's another different jordan right here this is a jordan 12 size 11 they're the i think these are the royalty taxis jordan 12s right here brand new and a size 11 they're going for 250 so 250 for that Let's go with this Jordan box right here. Black Jordan box. This is a Jordan 1 low golf shoe, size nine and a half. Hey, I haven't seen these golf shoes before. Just more of a newer release. Here it is, like a shadow colorway on this. Hopefully they're going for a decent amount, but yeah, here's the fifth shoe. And a size nine and a half. I'm gonna mark it at 135. 135 for that. Officially over a thousand, exactly a thousand five. Five shoes in. We still a good amount of shoes left, so let's keep it going here. Here is a Nike box. This is a Dunk Low. I don't know what that is at the end, but it's a size nine and a half. Oh, it's a reverse Brazils. Brand new. So I didn't even know these were released already, but super sick shoe right here. I actually really like these. They're my size. But yeah, let's see what they're going for. I'm curious to see if this is a, going for a good amount or not. But we're about to find out. So at the time I'm recording this, I don't think these released yet. It says release date isn't until February 15th. So it looks like an unreleased pair right here. But either way, they're not going for like much at all. Which is really surprising to me because it's a pretty sick colorway. But um, I'm going to mark it at 110. So 110 for that. That's when I'm at. Six shoes in. But let's keep it going. Don't have not seen a note yet, so hopefully there is one. But here's the next shoe, a 7 Youth Dunk. And here they are, has a receipt, which is always good. But here's the shoe. White, black, and blue colorway, and they are brand new. And 7 Youth for the Dunks, I'm going to mark it at 95. 
So 95, I'm at 1210. Here's everything I've gotten so far, everything brand new. I expect everything from the box to be DS as well. So that's what I told everyone. Here's another shoe with no box lid. These look like some Kyrie's. Kyrie basketball shoes. So a no box lid Kyrie basketball shoe. I don't know if I'm gonna get too much for this, but it's a size 11, the Kyrie Infinity. Here's the shoe. Yeah, they do look brand new. So here it is, not the best looking Kyrie shoe in my opinion. I have a few personals, but I don't know how I feel about these. But yeah, let's just move on and let's see what they're going for. But again, no box lid. So market's kind of weird on those. There's like a $60 difference between ask and bid. No, um, like I said, no box lid. I mean, they're just Kyrie basketball shoes. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get too much for it. I'm gonna market at like 40. <laughs> So 40 for that. Hopefully he didn't price those too high. I don't think he did, but yeah, let's just move on. Let's go with this dunk right here. Box is a little damaged. This is a dunk low, size eight and a half. And it's whatever these are. I've not seen these before, but here's the shoe. It's kind of different material on this one as well. And these are actually going for a decent amount. I was expecting like 110, 120. They're going for about 160 right now. So 160, I'm over 1400 now. After those dunks, still plenty of shoes left. There's about three right there. I think maybe seven more shoes. But still haven't seen a note yet. So hopefully there is one. Women's dunk low though, size seven, five and a half in men's. And another shoe I haven't seen before, but this is actually a pretty cool colorway. Very cool colors on this. Here's the design on this first shoe. And then this one I think is different. Yeah, you can see the different colors with the Nike swooshes. So yeah, here's the next shoe. Pretty good looking dunk right here. And a size seven in women's. They're going for about 135. 135 for that, that's when I'm at. This is 10 shoes in so far. So a lot of shoes for this box. Again, I'm just assuming this is 2000 just because I don't think I paid more than that for anyone. Here's this, a Dunk Low, size 5 youth. And it's another pair of those right there. So two pairs of these. I forgot what I even marked these up, but oops. But here it is again. And the size 5 youth, I'm going to mark it at 95. So 95 for that. Exactly 1640. Here we go, let's try to... I see another shirt, by the way. Let's see what this next shoe is. The woman's Dunk Low, size 10, eight and a half in men's. Here it is. I've seen a lot of pictures of these. I don't know exactly what they're called, but it's my first time getting them in hand. And these are actually pretty sick. I like the colorway on this. The design though, the colorway. It reminds me of an orange cream bar, but yeah, a good shoe right here. And a size 10 in women's for those, they're going for 130. It's called a peach cream, by the way, Dunk Low. So 130, that's when I'm at. I am 12 shoes in now with four more shoes to go. Let's give it the shoes first. This is a woman's Dunk High up, size 11. So nine and a half in men's. Oh, <laughs> here they are. Pretty sure this is just sitting on Nike app right now. Uh, yeah, this isn't my favorite looking dunk at all. Let me know what you guys think about this in the comment section, but I am not a <laughs> big fan of these. You know, size 11 to women, so I'm gonna mark this at 90. So 90 for that, 1860. So, so far, not really like any bangers in this. The most expensive shoe I'm pretty sure was the Jordan 12s, which was going for like around 250, but yeah, hopefully these last three shoes are good. Hopefully this box is pretty profitable, but here's the next shoe, a Dunk High size three youth. So a small size right here. And there are these white and green Dunks. This is another shoe I believe is just sitting on the Nike app and like the retail stores. But this is a pretty good colorway. The only thing I would say is, I mean, it's a really small size, but yeah, let's check out what they're going for though. The <laughs> market's very funny on these. Look at the highest bid, it's just $20. And then Lowe's asked 160. There's been no recent sales on this. So 
kind of harder price this retail was only 85 so i'll mark it a little less than retail so at like 80 so 80 for that 1940 just two shoes left or some like shirts and stuff too here's another shoe with no box lid i wish i would he would have said something about that before but here they are these are the foam finger dunks by the way size six youth here's the shoes my second time getting these though and these actually moved pretty fast last time it's a little dirty on the bottoms but i do think these are brand new so yeah here's the second to last shoe some foam finger dunks you can see the foam finger design all around and it's like six youth brand new going for about 100 no box lid i'm gonna mark it at 80. so 80 for that i'm at 2020. here's everything i've gotten so far one shoe to go and it looks like two different clothing so let's go with the shoe first there's also no no inside so i'm gonna have to do some digging in my dms but eight and a half women's right here seven and men's and they are the black and white dunk highs right here and they're brand new so here's the last shoe from the box and these panda dunk highs they're going for 130 so 130 for that exactly 2150 so far with 16 or yeah 16 shoes in everything brand new a couple shoes with no box lids get everything out real quick to see if there is a note so yeah i'm not seeing a note anywhere so oh here it is montage kicks so i probably shouldn't have opened it backwards so i could see that first but let's get both these out and i'll show you guys what these go for all right, so here's the two clothing that was inside the bags. Here's the first one, a Kawhi Leonard Clippers jersey, brand new. Um, the retail on this is 110, and it's a size medium. I messaged him how he priced these, by the way. He said the jersey, he marked it at around 40. So I'll just put it in 50. So that adds up to 2,200. And then those, he said he just threw in for free. So don't really need to count that towards the box, but the box was 2,020 and my total only came out to 2,200. And I'm pretty sure I priced everything pretty fair. So I'm going to ask him for his prices real quick to see what we're off on. And then I'll keep you guys updated in the next clip. So I moved everything. That's why everything is like right here now instead of over there. But um, I messaged him. We talked about it. He decided to lower the price to 1850 Because with 1850 this box with my prices would be 19% ROI. Pretty much close to my 20, which is what I look for. So shout out to Montage Kicks for working with me, helping me fix the price so the box would still be worth it. But yeah, let me know down in the comment section below though what you guys think of this mystery box and rate it out of 10. And let me know what your guys' favorite shoe is. My favorite from this would probably be the Reverse Brazils or these. I actually think these are pretty nice. I love the colors on them. So those would be my two favorites. Let me know your guys' favorites down in the comment section below. But yeah, that's pretty much going to wrap up today's video. If you guys haven't yet, please subscribe to this channel. Leave a like on the video, and I'll see you guys next time. I now do raffles on my Instagram daily, so if you're into that kind of stuff and want to join a future one, shoot my Instagram a follow. It's jcresells559. Same exact name as my YouTube name. Thank you guys for the support, and I hope to see you in the future raffle.